welcome to Fort Lauderdale, Florida. Today we'll be taking you on board this Ferretti 690 2013 named Su-2. Some of her key features include a Mitsubishi anti-rolling gyro stabilizer system, shore power converter, water maker, jet tender, and balanced stern thrusters. She has a four stateroom layout plus room for your crew. Let's take a full walkthrough. Beginning aft, Su-2 has a section of her transom that lifts up revealing her concealed telescopic davit that has a lift capacity of 875 pounds. She also has a hydraulic swim step that eases the transition of her Avon jet tender in and out of the water. Also on the transom is her Bezenzoni stainless and teak passerelle that is remote controlled. As you can see, deployment is very easy. As we enter the aft deck, you'll notice her rectangular teak dining table. There are also folding deck chairs that provide seating for eight. And on the port side is your cockpit ice maker. Also in the cockpit is your engine access. Su-2 is powered by MTU 8V2000M94s, offering 1,268 horsepower each. She also has two Onan generators. Now let's head up to the flybridge. Entering the bridge, you have a U-shaped settee on the starboard side with storage beneath. Across from that is your wet bar with electric grill and sink on top and a fridge with an ice maker on the bottom. Forward of the settee is your upper helm station. At the flybridge helm, you have a Simrad NSC12 multifunction display, autopilot, balanced stern thruster controls, and VHF radio. Continuing forward of the helm, you have an expansive sun pad that offers incredible views of your surroundings. Now before we head inside, we want to show you another unique feature. The aft deck and galley become seamless thanks to this pop-up window and sliding glass door. Now let's head inside and explore her beautifully designed interior. As we enter from the aft deck, the galley is on the port side with Bosch appliances and quartz countertops. You have a stove, four burner cooktop, dishwasher, and full fridge and freezer. The galley can also be completely separated thanks to this electrically operated partition. Moving forward from the galley, we enter the salon. Plenty of light pours in thanks to the electric blinds. A large leather settee to starboard complements your dining area on the port side. This dining table will also expand, allowing you to fit more friends and family. Continuing forward on the port side is a desk area that is perfect for storing your charts. Across from that is your lower helm station. You can also access this area through a watertight pantograph door to starboard. You have everything you need here, including two NSS-12 multifunction displays. Now let's head down below and walk through her four stateroom layout. On the starboard side is her first guest stateroom, side-by-side -side berths, hanging locker, and a flat screen TV. This stateroom also has an ensuite head that will serve as your day head as well. On the port side is your second guest stateroom, again fitted with side-by-side -side berths and another flat screen TV. All the way forward is your VIP stateroom. You have an Island Queen berth, plenty of storage, and a 19 inch flat screen TV. And your VIP head is identical to the day head. Your full beam master stateroom is located midships. You have a king size Island berth. On the port side is a leather settee and walk-in closet. And on the starboard side is a vanity with a leather ottoman and tons of storage. And of course you have your ensuite head, a large walk-in shower with tempered glass door. This master head feels like a spa in person. Ferretti implements incredible features into the 690 that can only be appreciated by experiencing it in person. For example, Su-2 has an electric differential steering system which independently varies the angle of each rudder, preventing the yacht from heeling too steeply into a turn. This incredible attention to detail is apparent throughout. If you'd like more detailed information on Su-2, feel free to contact Jay Rhodes. And stay tuned for our next video as Denison continues to highlight some of the best yachts on the market today.